They imagine wearing a fur coat. Keeping cool takes some extra measures when it's about 90 plus degrees. CBS 5's Laura Hand has a look at how the animals at the Syracuse Zoo are coping. This African crow works hard for Syracuse's zoo. Twice a day she performs in a bird show. And her reward? A cooling mist. They love that uh, any time of the year, most really, um, but in, on particular days that are really sunny and hot. When it's sunny and hot, like today, the zoo takes extra precautions for all its animals and makes it fun. Grizzly bears. Just like we humans like ice treats, heavy coated animals like these bears enjoy their frozen fruit salad. And the waterfowl get their share, too. Giving them ice treats, uh, which is some of their favorite food items, and icicles that we freeze in our walk in freezer. One of the things you'll see a lot of here at the zoo is misters. They're in many of the animal enclosures, and they figure if it's good for the animals, why not the people, too? So if you might be watching the white-lipped deer or the bison enjoy the misters that are, that are uh, blowing into their exhibit and, and getting wet. So we have them on the public walkway just adjacent to that, so the kids can run under there and get wet as well. The zoo's summer camps also take special precautions. So games take on a wet look and feel. Oh, 65. And from young to old, more concerns about the heat. At the Salvation Army's Senior Center, these people are coping by staying inside where it's cool and relaxing and getting plenty to drink. Hydration is the most important thing. And what's more important is that people in our community should look out for older adults and make sure, check on them twice a day and make sure they're drinking and they're also staying out of the heat. Good advice on this hot day and for the hot days to come. In Syracuse, Laura Hand reporting.